every day I I pray that some someday will be home. Maria Carr Jackson hasn't seen her daughter since mid-November and fears for her safety. The Regina Educational Assistant says her ex-husband, Michael Jackson, took the girl away to prevent her from being vaccinated against COVID-19. She has no idea where they are. She's only seven and to leave in hiding is not a good thing for her. She wanted, you know, her right. It's her right to be, to live in freedom. And she just needs to be, you know, to be home. Judges have revoked his custody rights and issued two court orders demanding the girl be returned to her mother. RCMP apparently went to her father's house to enforce the court orders, but no one was home. Last week, Michael Jackson appeared on an online talk show via video from an undisclosed location to air his views. He and the host exchanged unsubstantiated and disproven theories about COVID-19, about vaccines and about government control. The man said he took his daughter away to protect her from the vaccine. Maria Carr Jackson's lawyer says the situation is urgent. She says the girl's physical safety is a concern, but an ordeal like this can have lasting psychological effects as well. Her last day in school that she was at school was November 16th, to the best of my knowledge. She's not been in school since that time, and no one, no one really has seen her in the community. Jackson says she will never stop searching. She has a message for her daughter. I love you so much, and I will always be here for you. Uh, mommy is standing strong and uh, and that someday we will be together. Mary Carr Jackson and her lawyer say it's clear that the man has no intention of complying with the court order. They're hoping the public and police can help. Mr. Jackson was not available for comment. Jason Warwick, CBC News, Saskatoon.